and today I'm here with New York best-selling author Pierce Brown and Natasha Polis of Tashapolis on Big Two Power Couple. <sighs> Signing. His book signing. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah. So, where's your ring? What, what ring? What ring? Like, the ring. What ring is she talking about? I, like I, a candy I, ring? That's <laughs> so secretive. It's so cute. So, you're an author. Yeah. And your book, Red Rising, I heard that it takes place on Mars. Is mm. it like The Martian? No. It's. I mean, it's a man on Mars trying to lead a rebellion. So it's like Titanic? No, it's nothing like Titanic. Is it like You've Got Mail with Meg Ryan and Tom Hanks? That's my favorite. No. No, there's, Tom Hanks and Meg Ryan have nothing to do with this film. Could they play the people in the film? This is not a romantic film? comedy. It's about a 16-year-old. So I heard you on Once Upon a Time last week. That's very exciting. Yeah, it was. What character do you play? I, I didn't play a character. I was kind of like featured as a super fan. Super fan. Is that a new princess this season? No! Red Rising takes place on Mars. Kind of like The Martian, though, right? No, not like The Martian at all. So do you aspire to live on Mars? No, not particularly. Though, I think it's interesting that people would. What do you think gives you the right to write about it, then? I mean, did James Cameron want to live on the Titanic? Maybe. Just because I don't know if I want to live on the planet doesn't mean I can't write about it. I mean, I don't necessarily think Dante wanted to live in hell, but he wrote about Dante's Inferno. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, right? Maybe he yeah. would down there, had a little visit. So why Red Rising, Pierce? Why not Purple Rising? It's much more gender neutral. Well, red is the color of Mars. But red is red, not Red purple. for rage and Aries. Justin Bieber yeah. likes purple. Justin Bieber has nothing to do with my book. Justin, Justin Bieber is a hit singer. So Pierce, I heard you made it to the people's top 100 most beautiful people last year. How? No, not quite. It was, it was the, the Buzzfeed one. Are you insulted you're not the hottest author this year? Is there someone hotter this year? I heard this year went to Ransom Riggs. <laughs> Why is Golden Sun called Golden Sun? So the golds rule over the society, which is segmented into colors. You have blues, reds, pinks, purples. Oh, the that golds, sounds racist. Well, that's the point of it all. But it's, you know, my way of critiquing on race, as I see it now, but 700 years in the future. I see. So it's kind of like on Titanic. Have you seen any other movies besides Titanic? I hear your third book is called Morning Star. So my third book, yeah, it is called Morning Star. Is it about a star in the morning? No, no. Well, but Morning Stars were off, off the Do you like stars better in the morning than the evening? That's when I see stars. I think they can be more beautiful in the morning sometimes because you don't expect them. Yeah. And so when there's one left... I think it's pretty vague. I think I said something pretty clear. Yeah. yeah. Are you going to write about your story together next? Our story? Your story together. We're like meeting each other at the book signing? Yes. Well, and further. Pretty more. short story. Oh, yeah. No, and more. What? You mean with the, the video? <sighs> you seem very engrossed in Mars being that your books take place so much on Mars. Did you want to play the Martian in The Martian? I really didn't give much thought to The Martian. Did you want to play the main character? The one Matt Damon's play? Yes. I'm not an actor. But did you want to be him so you could be in Mars? No, I don't. What would you say are your spirit animals? Lisa, I'm curious, what's your spirit animal? My spirit animal is Creature. Well, Beyonce is my spirit animal then. Taylor Swift for me. I want to pick Taylor Swift though. Pick Sorry. a different one. No, she's mine. No. Lisa, she's mine. This is my show. No, mine. This was supposed to be about my book. So, Pierce, your name is Pierce Brown. Are there colors in every title of your book? Because there's a color in your name. You know, I never gave that much thought, but maybe it goes back to childhood. Exclusive. So, are you happy with hashtag Piersha as your ship name? Hashtag what? Piersha. That's the ship name. <laughs> Thank you for joining us today, Pierce Purple and Natasha Parlis. You've been great. Be sure to check out Pierce's book, and it's coming out. Um, it already came out. It's two out. Year, two years ago. Yeah. It's out. There's two more. Then Golden Sun. Yes, and then Morning, Morning Star. Star. 
yeah. and be sure to check it out it comes out soon i'm lisa this is Piersha. <clears throat> we're off to the wedding now no 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 i'm lisa thanks for watching i'll talk to you next time goodbye but we're talking about mars where my book is set so like the martian it's not the fucking martian So I'm actually Christine, and this is actually Pierce Brown. Hi. And this is actually Natasha. Hi. This is Pierce's book, Red Rising. This is the second book, Golden Sun. And Morning Star is coming out February 12th. Be sure to check them out. They actually do take place on Mars. That's real. That was real. Do you want to give a little schnapp? Yeah, the book is about a young man who schnapp. wages a war against. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Yeah, uh, the book is about a young man who wages a war for love. It's set 700 years in the future. Humanity has expanded past the solar system, or past uh, Earth. It's like colonizing Mars, right? Yeah. Yes. Should I say that? Yeah. All right. Well, it's your book. Yeah, yeah. it's your book. I don't know, but are we That's how I would it? describe oh, okay. it. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> no, you go. No, yeah, so it's colonizing Mars, but it's humanity has expanded past Earth and has started colonizing the other planets and also terraforming them a little bit. It actually sounds like <laughs> interstellar a little bit, except more developed. You know? Yeah. Like You're they not Lisa anymore. Planets. What? Are you Lisa still? <laughs> no, 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 but like this is really when I started reading it. I was like, oh, so it's like they developed a planet to live on. They're doing it. Yeah, but yeah. not like interstellar because they leave our system. No, no, yeah, yeah. It's like in but Mars. Yeah, but it's like yeah, if they found yeah, a planet exactly, to be yeah. on. Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. Go ahead. And so it's about. <laughs> sorry. No, I was just kidding. <laughs> I'm gonna start him off. <laughs> it's about a young man within the society who is a slave and then joins the upper ranks of the society to infiltrate them and help lead an uprising from the inside. Very cool. It's a story of war and love. Yes. I just started the audiobook, guys, so I will be book talking it soon. So I should pick it up so we can read it together. Natasha just interviewed Pierce for realsies, so you should check that out. Mm -hmm. And they put a nerd off. Who do you think won? <clears throat> you have to, you have to watch to find out. It, it was me. It you was never, me. you never know. You never know. Thank you so much for watching this. Thank you for being a good sport. Thanks for having me. Yeah. Yeah. Tolerating yeah. my yeah. uncomfortable questions. Hashtag Pierce. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Christine. I'm Natasha. I'm Pierce. Bye. Now, for this first section, I, sorry, I'm already talking weird. Okay. Um, I'm trying not to laugh. I'm trying not to smile. I'm trying to understand you. <laughs> okay. You're so affable. <laughs> Did James Cameron want to live on the Titanic? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> we got it out again. Why not Purple Rising? It's much more gender neutral. <laughs> sorry, we got it out again. That was really good. <laughs> Purple <laughs> Rising. <laughs> That's gonna, be the, that's, gonna be the, that's gonna be the porn one. <laughs> like a candy ring? The ring? The, the one ring, ring to rule them all? all? You like Lord of the Rings? <laughs> Have you even read The Martian? <laughs> so, like The Martian. It's not The Fucking Martian. <laughs>